from Skippy6 Gaming coming to you with what is going to be glitch of the year. This glitch is so super awesome. This video might take me a little bit to show you, but sit tight, pay attention, and uh, we are about to do something awesome. This glitch is going to let you, listen to this, take your survival world, put it into creative, and then put it back in survival and get all your trophies. Uh, basically, long story short, you could take any survival world, put it into creative, and then put it back and forth into survival get your trophies do what you want you can change spawners to enderman spawners and put your end portal anywhere you want uh, have uncraftable blocks in your game so let's start this so hopefully this won't take too long i'm going to try to go through this quick so uh, that said i'm going to warn you right now blob right here is one of the worlds uh, that i did it in i didn't use one of my main worlds however you could uh, you are doing it at your own risk so uh, number two you do need playstation plus to do this so that's pretty straightforward and uh, number Number three, I'm going to give a big shout out to Knucklehead. Knucklehead uh, isn't quite the biggest YouTuber. He's not really, that's not his big focus, but a uh, super cool dude. I had a good chat with him the other day uh, and uh, we really worked our way. It took like a half a day to figure out exactly how this glitch works. That way I can explain to you guys exactly how it goes. So basically what we're going to do is here, let's just go ahead and give the world a name. I'm going to make a fresh new world. Again, you can use your, if you want to make your normal survival world and do this, that's good. Just make sure you back it up to a USB first. That way, if you mess something up, uh, you don't mess up your survival world. So let's go ahead and call this one uh, glitch. Glitch. Okay, so this is our glitch world. So now we're in survival. It's on hard. Do whatever you want. Set up whatever you want. I'm going to just go ahead and uh, make some people not join us here while we do it. But you could set anything the way you want. Totally random seed. Survival hard. Cool. La da da da. Let's go. So we're going whole new fresh survival world who knows what's going to be there uh it's pretty good it's pretty exciting so uh like i said you can change mob spawners if you use this glitch in your survival world you can have a creeper spawner a cow spawner uh you can move your end portal i think that's probably the number one thing you're going to do with this glitch i would love to just take my end portal and put it in my base uh, that said, you could do it this way and uh, not lose anything and still get your trophies and have a complete legit survival. Well, semi-legit, I guess legit isn't the word. Uh, here we go. Perfectly, blatantly boring, normal survival world. Uh, that's a pretty cool render. You know, every world I go into the last couple days has looked really cool. So as you can see, it's survival. So what we're going to do is we got our world. Let's go out of here. Let's go exit game. Okay. So as you can see, we've exited our game and now we're going to leave. So at that point in time, what I'm going to do is actually close application. Let's go. Why was I going to a party? Um, let's go ahead and close the application right here. So our world is saved. It's there. It's whether whatever world it is. So go up here and go to your settings. Now go up here and go to application save data management. Once you're in here, there's a few things you're going to want to do so first go to auto upload i have already done this but this is the number one way you're going to mess this up and make sure that minecraft is no longer auto uploading to the cloud for playstation plus anything else can that's fine this one doesn't so that's good make sure it's there go back here and go save data in system storage click on it upload to online storage yes and then we go and guess what we're going to do we're going to go into minecraft and we're going to take the glitch world so when this happens here, guys, don't even don't even bother worrying about it. Just take the first world, not world data one, just this one called Glit, just the main world. Press it, upload it. So now this is uploading up to the cloud. It's there. It's cool. Yay. So now what we're going to do is leave this, go over back to Minecraft, keep on going, and then we're going to go into this world. On creative we're gonna switch it to creative we are going to add some stuff I'm just gonna be quick because this video uh, is already four minutes long I'm trying to get this done quickly I'm just trying to make sure I hit every point because literally this what this glitch was a little challenge for me when I heard about it from knucklehead I was I had to play with it for like a half a day you know I was trying to mess mess with it but little things matter so go in here let's go over to the load screen the glitch world so let's just go up there you could change whatever you want uh, don't change your spawn point that's the only thing that you can't change so let's creative it's gonna say uh, if you load blah 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 and here we go into this world so now this world is no longer survival this world is creative and we can jump around fly around I could take a look at that mountain like I wanted to before 
and we look around, it loads up. So let's just go ahead and jump into our creative menu and show you a few of the things. So first things first, anything that you keep in your hands won't be there when you switch it. So if you wanna keep anything from this, uh, you're gonna have to take it and put it in a chest. So let's just go here and let's just grab end portal frames, this, and then let's just get uh, Enderman eggs because then you can make Enderman spawners. Again, you could do anything you want. This is the way to get all your eggs in your world, your heads, you know, that's another thing you could do. There's, bang, creeper heads, Steve heads, whatever you want, all in your survival world. So let's go down here. Let's go ahead and just leave a spot so we know. We're gonna just make a quick end portal. Again, the best thing about this, putting your end portal in your base. And let's grab our Eyes of Ender, make it lit. And then let's uh, grab a chest, dump the stuff we have, and there you go. So it's lit. Cool. Let's go over here, grab a chest, put the chest on the floor, put this stuff here, grab the chest, put everything. Oh, I just do it this way. Again, there's the notes, but every time I've made it work, it involves emptying my entire inventory into a chest. Once that's done, we got an end portal. We got the stuff we want. Okay, cool. So now what we're going to do... Exit game, it's gonna save. Just make sure it saves, that's okay. Bang. So we're saving our level. We're good to go, let's check the world. Let's see what it says. Glitch world in creative mode. Okay, so now we're kind of nailed. We're not gonna get any trophies. It's not gonna be good. Uh, you can see the picture for the save there. It shows, it shows the end portal. It shows everything that I put in there. But once we do this, that picture is gonna change back to the original, however the world will be Different. So what we're going to do is go ahead and get out of Minecraft, close application, and then we're going to go back to our settings here and we're going to hit the settings. We're going to go to application, save data management. We're going to go to saved data in online storage. So we're going to go there, bang, download to system storage, bang, and we're going to go to Minecraft. We're going to find the glitch world. There's the one from yesterday. So we're going to grab this one, see how it doesn't show anything in front of me, right? bang download once it's coming from the online storage you're going to want to overwrite it so say yes yes and there you go so now let's get out of here we're out of here we're out of here let's go back to minecraft and we're going in let's go on in let's go on in keep on going minecraft what are you doing bro be love come on um going through going through i think they know the game knows like skippy you'd be cheating the system right now you know you're a hacker i'm not a hacker come on so once we go in as you're gonna see glitch world created in survival mode so load it up and there you go Bingo, bango, look at this. This is pure survival. You can pop trophies. We have tested it. I have platinum on all my accounts, but as you can see, we are in survival mode. There is no host options. There's no nothing. And we will continue our life with our nether, with our end portal right here. Holy cow. So on that note, this is the number one way that you could go ahead and uh, hack the system. Go ahead and put this uh, in your world. Take your world, move your end portal, move everything. Uh, I'm not sure the mechanics about, I think you might have to break it. I don't know. This is going to be funky stuff, but if you haven't lit your end portal, then I'm pretty sure you could do it this way. Uh, that said, this world has an end portal right there. Super cool. Guys, I'm going to go ahead. I know Knucklehead's not the biggest YouTuber, and I even said, I'm like, you know, I'll shout you out on the channel. And he's like, oh, well, you know. So long story short, I am going to see what I did too. <laughs> now I'm nailed. I have no, I have nothing to get out of here. <laughs> okay, so. Long story short, I'm going to link Knucklehead's channel in the description below. You know, if you think this is a notch awesome glitch, show him some love. He works hard on the videos he does, and uh, he's a super cool dude. You probably see him in my Crazy Craft Let's Plays coming up soon. So thanks a lot, guys. This is an awesome glitch. Do my do me a favor and share it. Tell everybody about it. This is the first, other than Knucklehead's video, this is the first big video about this. So I hope everybody spreads the word. And when you see everybody else remake this video, remember Skippy and Knucklehead brought it to you first. Don't forget to smash that like, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one.